The 9A91 is a Russian assault rifle which can be found in weapon set 5. It's CR weapon which is very good in close combat. All weapon stats you may see on your screen, but it's worth to mention that this gun has slightly higher damage than AK-105 and lower recoil, higher mobility and faster reload speed. However, low magazine capacity of 20 rounds can make survival difficult when surrounded by enemies, so a good sidearm is recommended when using this gun. It's very effective on distance and I found it to be the best at medium distance. You may want to control your fire and most of the time tap fire. Not only that you will save ammo but your weapon will remain very accurate. I have to mention that this weapon is better than some GP weapons, so price of 490 GP is acceptable for unbreaking 9A91. Iron sights are very hard to use but luckily there is a weapon task which is 50 double kills, before it was 50 triple kills and was very hard to achieve. Anyway, once complete you will be rewarded with micro H1 red dot and suppressor. This will improve the weapon performance and sight will make this weapon easier to use. All in all, you will enjoy in effort that you invest to task 9A91. For those guys who are boring and don't have time to deal with weapon tasks, they can buy it for 300 GP, but I will recommend you rather to go on with unbreaking this weapon and tasking it by yourself. It doesn't have customization option for now, but I believe in near future this weapon will get it and like that become more popular since only few guys around Contract Wars are using it. Anyway, let's check out my today's gameplay that I prepared for you guys. This time I've been testing it on Interchange Deathmatch. Hey guys, much one here and today we are playing with 9A91 and for a change I'm on interchange that match which is a little bit laggy as you can notice on your screen but I will try my best to record the gameplay with 9A91 actually I haven't been playing for a while and you can check when was the last time I've been using this weapon so in today's video I just wanna try and make sure that this weapon is really worth 490 GP to be unbreak uh, because recently I've been watching Oh my god, this guy surprised me. I've been watching some uh, YouTube videos when uh, where I saw uh, some old guys using 9A91. It was awesome on normal mode, uh, but I guess I have to get a little bit used to uh, Red Dot because it's not the same as on HK417D, which... I've been using all the time and I have to say that I really got used to it so previously I've been talking about sights and weapon shaking left and right it's really causing me a problems and it will take a time till I stabilize this weapon not to shake too much left and right and of course to get used to uh, this kind of sight and iron dot Anyway, excuse me because I'm not the guy who like to play that match, so I'm a little bit lost even if I know this map very well, but uh, using 9A91 for the first time and plus it's not unbreak, it's a little bit harder because it will reduce my accuracy on the distance and accuracy will drop by the time as much as I fire this weapon you will notice that it's not accurate but uh, that's why I wanna share this video with you guys and help you out maybe someone else of you will try to use this weapon and wait this guy was under me so uh, probably I will unbreak it after I finish this video because I wanna try some uh, other maps so if you see me today around playing with 9A91 you may know what I'm trying to do uh, because in my opinion I haven't really seen so many guys using this one and I wanna be the first one who will get used and uh, I mean I just wanna start using it maybe like that I will push people more to play with CR weapons because around control force we have guys who are just complaining hey you have a GP weapon it's not fair I cannot play I need GP blah 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 so let's push them to play more with CR weapon and let's make this game great again because people will just realize that it's possible to play uh, with those CR weapons they are there for a reason and of course 
I really been destroyed by this guy named Race. <laughs> so let's try to focus a little bit on it uh, on this gameplay and see actually what I'm able to do. I just hope I'm not gonna make a shame because I'm talking and recording behind my back. You can see there is no green screen because I haven't had idea uh, that I will try to record something like this, but suddenly I just got it. I was just like, hey, let's go in game and record a uh, gameplay with this weapon. Let's try interchange uh, because recently I've seen people playing this map. So, whoop. oh my god, that was a really nice hip fire and bullet through his head. So, this weapon is really bad if you're gonna use it with Tyrant Sight, so definitely I do not recommend you to try anything. Uh, yes, it will have a little bit more penetration and a little bit more uh, damage, but I will not uh, exchange it for this sight. Somehow it's unique, it's awesome. And I hope in future if they add customization on it, they're not gonna ruin this sight. I just wanna keep it. But something is telling me they will add micro H1 like you can find on M4 at the moment so yeah it's the one that is on SA58 I don't have anything against that one but I'm just afraid that they maybe will add something like Vityaz uh, micro H1 so it's really really small but I don't want to talk about that we'll have to wait and see what will happen but I'm pretty sure this weapon will get customization very very fast because nothing has been done uh, recently no weapons on customization so uh, I guess at the end of the next month we may expect to see some weapons on customization I hope they will add more snipers because we need that and they gonna use some nice assault rifles or maybe hmm I don't know maybe Vitya's SMG why not so far I think I'm getting a little bit used to this uh, weapon sounds is just amazing I'm most of the time trying to enjoy the sound how it pluck 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 so I have to admit yeah I'm pretty much in love in, with this weapon and I will not regret even if I waste 490 GP to unbreak it because uh, in my opinion definitely it's worth unbreaking but you guys can help me out and let me know down in comments what you think about this weapon I'm watching you on the YouTube nice and hello for you Jayco 55 I hope I did pronounce your name dude if you're watching me on YouTube I hope you will see yourself in my video you is the best you is best hey <laughs> thanks a lot man mm, anyway guys let me know down in the comments what you think about this weapon would you recommend me to unbreak it or are you using it or if you had some extra GP would you unbreak it so I'm really curious to see and hear what you think about it because I've been reading that this weapon is very very effective at uh, close combat but still I believe to what I've seen and not what I've been reading because uh, in my opinion this is the best and most effective on medium distance and hip fire as you can notice sucks so we can compare it right now to as well mode 3 and say that as well mode 3 is firing faster and at the same time it has 30 bullets and it's much accurate and better more effective while hip firing while on AK9 uh, 9A91 you will want to use aim down the side all the time and of course at the same time you will want to avoid hip firing and really really close combat I'm not sure about normal mode but we are talking about weapon stats uh, that I tested or I'm still testing on hardcore so just stick with aim down the side it will be your best friend on hardcore definitely so 
Nice. I, I have a feeling that I've did pretty enough kills. So I'm not I'm not doing bad, hey, for someone who who just decide to jump in that match for a change and I know I have on my mind that I shouldn't be playing that match uh, with assault weapons and SMGs are doing a lot of better in close combat but hey I don't know why I, I just wanted something else for a change plus I forgot to mention not only sight is good on uh, this weapon but sound is amazing plus reloading animation is just pure awesome I just love it I think I could reroll re reload this weapon record <laughs> reload this weapon all day long and listen to the sound of it it's just lovely so I think I will jump after this round on my side map to test it out what I'm gonna be able to do there because I don't know I don't know I haven't unbreak this weapon but after the match I will do it right now but I will be happy to read your feedback what you have to say about this one and really really I am curious to hear what you think about I hope older players who've been playing uh, contract force previously I've seen them using this weapon will come on this video to comment and tell me what they think so this was the last kill oh my god 41 kill I haven't been expecting to see this anyway I hope you did enjoy if you are new around there uh, don't sit in the shadow feel free to join Marshall one army subscribe to my channel leave a like button if you did enjoy tell me your opinion about the video and 9a91 thanks for watching guys and I'm gonna catch you in one of my next videos Videos. Bye bye.